Good morning children today we shall learn more about salt Now we already know salt is the term used for the substances which are produced in an acid base reaction It means salts are produced in some neutralization reaction Like here hydrochloric acid reacts with the base sodium hydroxide In this reaction sodium chloride is formed which is a salt salt is a very common chemical we are surrounded by it for example table salt baking soda washing soda chalk alum also known as fit curry minerals like magnetite etc all are salt even soap is made of of a salt made from fatty acid Salts are generally solid. Salt melts at high temperature and then it boils too. Table salt which is NaCl is soluble in water. Many other salts are soluble too like sodium carbonate, aluminum nitrate, ammonium carbonate etc. But not all salts are soluble in water. For example, silver chloride copper carbonate etc are insoluble salts you know few salts can form crystals after combining with water molecules like copper sulfate molecules form beautiful blue crystals combining with water molecule each molecule combines with five water molecule this water in crystal is called water of crystallization and such salt is called hydrated salt on heating the hydrated salt loses its water molecule as the result it loses its shape color and turns into powdery substance like if we heat copper sulfate crystal it loses its shape and turns into white powder this powdery salt is called anhydrous salt it has no water molecule attached to the salt molecule you know different salts are used for different purposes as we know common salt is used for cooking we can get common salt from hydrochloric acid potash alum commonly called fit curry is used for water purification it is found in crystal form it is sodium sulfate potassium sulfate with 24 molecules of water of crystallization and it can be obtained from sulfuric acid another salt ammonium nitrate is used in production of fertilizer explosive etc it can be obtained from nitric acid silver nitrate yet another salt is used in developing photography films it can be obtained from nitric acid too few other useful salts are washing soda baking soda calcium carbonate which is the main component of chalk marble stone limestone is a salt these salts can be obtained from carbonic acid which is h2co3 So to summarize what we learned today what is a salt salts are substances that are formed when acid and base react with each other which is the neutralization reaction For example when potassium hydroxide that is KOH which is a base reacts with nitric acid HNO3 then potassium nitrate that is KNO3 and water is formed in this neutralization reaction so here potassium nitrate produced is a salt and what are the properties of a salt salts are mostly solid a salt melts when heated and even boils at high temperatures the salt molecules combine with water molecules to form crystals such salts are called hydrated salt 
For example, copper sulfate molecule combines with five water molecules to form beautiful blue crystals. On heating, hydrated salt loses its water molecule and turns into white powdery substance. When hydrated salt loses its water of crystallization, it turns into powdery anhydrous salt. So that was all about salt. Bye bye children.